Coming up next on Nick at Night, weeknight update with Ellie Mueller. Then, the wee hours with Craig Knightley. Followed by, movie night with Will DeVacus. That's next on Nick at Night. Tonight on Week Not Update, for airing on November 16th, 2020, or whenever, or, or whenever you're seeing this, we're going to find out why I Gloom and Tim Gunn uh, stole a play from Amazon, and also learn why Heidi Gloom and her family decided to make a horror film. Keep in mind that it's probably uh, Heidi Gloom's decision alone. All that and more tonight on Week Not Update. From the YouTube Dog Show, far away from Heidi Klum's End Story Mansion, it's Week Not Update with Ellie Mueller. And now, a man who thinks that Heidi Klum, let's be honest, is uh, nutty and goofy and just plain ridiculous. Ellie Gunny Mueller. Ha! Welcome to Week Not Update. I'm Ellie Gunny Mueller with Summer Cry Talks. <laughs> Oh boy, the announcer is really getting loopy. I'm telling you, somebody needs to keep an eye on that guy. Anyway, tonight's Chaos Fight winner for Specs by Canada Stand Edits, Neb 509, his Vigilante videos and dance, uh, and Vigilante um, and his gameplays and whatnot. First of all, his commentaries, uh, although hmm, he's practically done with uh, YouTube for a while. Navarcus with his uh, movie night program. And the uh, trio known as Marvin the Maniac, Dr. Blood Studios, and Cassie Dragon. I. You know, they basically do slideshows, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Let's get on with, uh, with the show, and more importantly, tonight's topic, which is, uh, or who is, I should say, Heidi Klum, a woman who wants everything. Well, which fashionistas. Love doing everything to get everything on Earth. Uh, instead of having a Halloween party on Halloween this year, she released a short horror film on Instagram. Her husband and her kids were involved in the film and she was very scary. I said this once before, kids. Don't touch her money. Serious, don't touch her money. Hey, you, you might want to listen to this. She and Tim Gunn were able to take money away from Amazon to do a show on Amazon Prime Video. It's called Making the Cut. And they even took a plane from Amazon. Really? Are you nuts? Why would you even steal a plane? Why? I'm serious. Stealing planes, huh? Come on. Boy, anyway, a bunch of animals? Need some, uh, 101 Dalmatians? Please! Top of the top eight list! What's the category? Stop! Eight things that Ben Gillum would like to make movies about. It's Heidi Klum. Heidi Klum? Yeah. I don't know Klum. Anyway, number eight, money. Number seven, arms. Armpits. Pits. Number six, beards. Number five, your motherfucking nail. Or your curse. Number four, your eggs. Number three, oranges. I'll choose an orange. Number two, sharks. Oh! Number one, shopping. Yeah. Shopping. Oh boy, we'll be back. People still call it week now. Now here it is, your final night. We will. Can you go faster? Nah, it's more fun this way. When it's nighttime, cross the nation. Stay on your favorite station.
delicious, it's a viewer's delight. Nick, 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 Nick at night. Isn't this a gorgeous carpet? Lots of companies in Chicago carry this carpet, and they'll all charge you roughly the same price. But only one company has the means to deliver it in one day, and in fact, will guarantee to deliver it in one day. And you know which company. Empire! Right, and if we don't deliver it to you in one day, we'll pay your sales tax for you. 588-2300, Empire! Empire today, carpet tomorrow. Or, or we, we pay, pay the, the sales, sales tax. tax. Boys, ladies and gentlemen, Ed, how are you doing tonight, buddy? I'm doing fine. How about yourself? I'm doing all right. You know, I, I spent uh, the whole weekend recovering from uh, from my last week's uh, shows and everything else. Hey, you're getting better. You know, uh, shows up to a warm start. Thanks. Thank you very much. You know, this brings me to to tonight's uh, moment for everyone, you know? People always ask me, hey, Mr. Mueller, why do you think that uh, the show has gone uh, so well, so far, in 2020? And I said, well, partly, uh, uh, well, uh, the fact that God has kept me alive uh, throughout uh, this entire year, that's a huge factor, and so are the people who work here on the show, and all you folks at home, alright? Now, everybody together has managed to come uh, together and uh, make this show work, you know, and it also really helps if uh, people have been uh, staying home uh, more often than not so you can see a show. <laughs> so, thank you. You know, you're staying safe by, uh, you know, by uh, staying inside and uh, everything else. And for your reward, you get this show. And more importantly, you get to have some talking time with us. Let's see what it's all about. Let's talk about it. Let's go. Let's talk about it. All right, 1808, BBC, before you, before your common era, all the chickens, all the lickens, all together, 808, 804, in the AM, PM, morning, afternoon, evening, night, time, all times of the day, they performed this song, and they invented what is now known as the talking time, you know, uh, part of the day. Can we say E? E. Look at the dog! It's very refreshing! Look at the dog! Now, you want to get rid of this? The American Stops and E. It sure is that me. Now, welcome back, guys, to Cat and E and Cat and May. Talking time extravaganza. Now, today. Sometimes this is getting confusing. Now, today we're talking about Hindi Clum. Heidi Klum. Heidi Klum. Listen to this, okay? You know, listen to this, okay? You know, uh, instead of the usual Halloween parties or uh, trick or treating or things like that, Heidi Klum might decide to do something different for Halloween this past year. She released a short horror film on Instagram with her husband and four children. Four children? Yeah. I feel bad for him. Yo, is yeah. she okay? Yeah, somebody stole her money, apparently. But anyway, listen to this, okay? 
in the in the short film, uh, Clum and her family are enjoying a socially distanced Halloween at home until lightning strikes, causing the Super Bowl's kids to turn into zombie mummies in case they're around the house. Uh, Clum uh, said, It was such a fun way to get the whole family involved, and my kids really enjoyed the process. Even though they have come to visit me on set many times throughout the years, they have never been in front of the camera like this learning how to remember lines and how to create costumes and makeup for a short film. Oh, I feel bad. Man, like, yo, first of all, don't die and make no sense. And she said, just because we can't go out does not mean we can't be creative and have fun. I feel bad for the kids. Mommy, what are you doing? It's art, kids. Mommy, you're scaring me. Shut up, you ankle biter. <laughs> Shut up, you ankle biter. Oi, babe. Bro, imagine that. Calling your kid an ankle biter and going like... Yo, well, it should, be what, it should be what uh, she did with Tim uh, Gunn, uh, you know, not too long ago. Yeah, they took that Amazon's uh, money and bought a plane with it. They bought a plane with it. To uh, do making the cut on Amazon Prime Video. Okay, but did they make that money, or uh, or did they just say I'm gonna need a small loan of a billion dollars? They okay, get the second short. Listen. Okay, great. Right here, you want our money back? You right? I'm about to play, I'm about to play the Illy, we do the dance of Illy, whoa, 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 then we're gonna buy a band, call them the barrel, all that, all that, they capped, they capped, mm -hmm. I'm just telling you, they capped, now, uh, like he said, we were kind of hoping uh, to get a big Amazon plane, because I was already thinking about commercials we can shoot, like Tim Gunn and I uh, hopping out of a plane with Amazon boxes delivering them to people. You know, and then she said, uh, okay, my brain was going 100 miles an hour. A plane would have been nice with sewing machines in there. Like, okay, the first assignment is not in New York, it's in Paris. But guess what? You open a plane, they go in there, and there are sewing machines everywhere. You're not laying back and enjoying the flight. You're designing, you're designing a miserable. Amazon said yes to a million dollar prize. So we were like, let's not push our luck here. And I'm like, really? And they did it this year. Heidi Klum and Tim Gunn. Wow. So they made a movie this year? No, they made a TV show. Okay. That's all similar to Project Runway. Which I don't think it's on the air anymore. Runway was, but they about to run away when when folk go. I want my money. Somebody call for money. Where my money? And then the, and then they like I don't know. And then they catch up. It's the same thing as a project runway, where all the contestants have to uh, make uh, costumes for uh, the models. What's it called? The show is called Making the Cut. For some reason, I think uh, that people are just running out of ideas real quick. Bad. Very bad. Can we please get a B A D N in chat? Uh, we actually oh, have comments. Yo, we're just live streaming, but just the, the live is so old that it comes out to, to, today. I this was actually re re recorded in 1808 BBC. Yes, all these shows here, we're we are we're predicting the future. We know when this is going to come out because of the complicated math that came out in 18 B B B B B B B B C. Yeah, and that's before our common era, which is before before your common era. That's three hope of force. That's weird. 
Long story short, Amazon made $75.5 billion in revenue. Which was why Amazon gave Heidi Klum and Tim Gunn the right to uh, make that show. And I'm like, no! Really? Really? Yeah! They made the pitch like 2018, you know, but it didn't uh, come to uh, fruition until this year. If that's not uh, a rotten idea, that uh, it's taken uh, Amazon two years to, uh, to accept, I have no idea. Again, it's all your fault, Amazon. All your fault. Main lesson to uh, take from main lessons to take to take out of this uh, show right here tonight. It, there are these two things, okay? All right. I mean, Heidi Klum wants to make a film, but number one, number two, do not trust Amazon Prime Video because the people over there will screw you up big time. The idea will not be good. Tomorrow we're talking about Howie Mandel. Now on Wednesday, HBO Max, then on Thursday, Hulu, then on Friday, Olivia Holt will be our topic with Never Over Nine in the Vodkas, the Anthony Pentex Show, hopefully, Let's Books, Michael Zach Cast, Rebecca Kane, and that's like Spike and Vortex, 73G VA Studios. By the way, she's feeling a lot better. By the way, she's starting to feel better, and, and we are waiting to hear uh, how well she's actually feeling. And we're also have by Motor Fireflies 97 and Employment J2 exclamation mark. Thank you so much for being here. I'll see you back here again tomorrow. That's news. I'm Alski. Spill all back for well. When it's nighttime cross the nation, stay on your favorite stations. It's a viewer's delight. Nick, 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 nick at night.